Well, hello folks off YouTube. My name's Ian and I'm out and about. And as they say, never look a gift horse in the mouth. Let's have a look. Now to be quite honest, there's not much in because I've already put it in the car. But we got a lamp. Magnifying lamp. We've got these. I don't think they're brass. I think they're uh, just die cast. But they're easy enough to get off, so just won't twist them. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Like I say, I've already been up the other end. I'll show you when I get to the car. How much trouble do we go to? That's the question. Take much, take much effort to do that, is it? And as they say, every bit helps. Let me see what I can help. Yeah. There's another one there. And there's another one on there. I spot either that could be a piece of cable just down there, and there's certainly something shiny somewhere. Something shiny there. Go have a look at that. All the lamps in the back with the kitchen sink that came out. The shiny thing turned out to be some uh, cutlery. Uh, look at that! It's like a motorbike cock. Yeah, I might have a subscriber or two you might be interested in that. Battery, air dryer. Well, I don't need an air dryer, do I? and a tiny bit of copper. Every little helps. Right, we better go make our way home, aren't we? However, I've just got out of the car and the neighbours said, I've got some radiators for you if you want them. So I think we'll get those and then we'll see if we can fit anything in the shed. Uh, and this kind gentleman who's given me those radiators has just asked me well, what I consider to be a rather stupid question. <laughs> what is it you just said? Well, you just asked me something. Did you want these radiators? And something else. And something else. And you want these bits? Yeah, do, do I? Do <laughs> I want these bits? Do I want some brass? I mean, hang on. Can a fish swim? You know, can a pig fly? Of course I want some brass. Well, are you getting a problem that you take the Hey, people. don't swear you're on YouTube. Who's YouTube? YouTube. YouTube. Do you know I keep saying, well... I, Welcome to the Fork Off YouTube. And it sounds so different when I say it like that. Anyway, uh, Graham, just let me... Uh, we go to just let it. me take this lot off you first. Brassy goodness. Good job I've not so far to go. I'm on it to the side of that blue car. Hey. Are you, are you bringing them round for me? That one's too heavy for me. 78 year old, this guy. Too. I know, yeah. Unbelievable, look at That's that. It. Throwing small radiators around like nobody business. Where do you, where do you want them? Just there. Off the garage. Anywhere. Well, you're, 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 now you think it was like Stormy's garage this, wasn't you? You know, all these cans. But these are all full. <laughs> Oi, do you mind knowing me? Cider. Beer. Oh, I'm, I'm, I have to leave. I'm not leaving. Look at that. You can't see that, can you? I'll bring this out so, out so you can see it. Where are you? Yeah. Right, Don't you take that? that that's that, that's, that's nice, isn't it? That's nice. I've got to put it back. You'll well, accuse yeah, me of robbing. Right, let me take that out. Well, hours and hours later, walking with these on my back. Uh, we've got them in safe storage. Don't show those scrapping Irish. I'll have to come back. And take the uh, take the brass bits off. I need to lock this up. There was a there was a, a smooth talking Irishman round here the other day. Okay, right. So what have we got? Well, we've got four bags from the inverter guy. Pick two inverters up from the inverter guy. 
we went into that dumpster and we picked up some bits we'll have a look at those in the shed and along with a sink which may or may not be stainless steel oh yeah it's all stainless steel Even winner winner two taps as well that'll go over there and we've got the two radiators we still need to take the brass off right let's see if we've got room in the shed well probably a little difficult for you to tell but uh, i've actually made quite a bit of space uh, with what's more obvious is i've got my bench back uh, well i had my bench back i'm just about to fill it now so uh Oh, and they're chunky, look at the size of them. Right, let's get this stuff on the bench. And just like that, my bench is full. Easy peasy going through the bag. You have seen all this stuff before. You know, cable and bits of copper. Right. Plug the air dryer in, switch that on. That one. What do I want air dryer for? Well, I don't know. If I'm going to do a bit of aluminium smelting and I want to, you know, a bit of put some uh, air through it, then that'll come in handy. Right. Stainless steel pan, aluminium pan. Broken and burnt out socket, but full of brass. We've got the handle, we've got the brass link chain, some cutlery. Oh, we've got another one of them knives that have been sharpened a lot. Okay, a, a bread knife, steak knife, scissors. we got that lamp, it's melted there, so that looks like he's had the wrong type of lamp in there will tell you they'll say something like maximum 60 watts maximum 60 watts he's obviously had something way too hot brass ends too winner winner put it with the other brass uh, every bit helps oh he's had it close to something that's melted by the way, I think we'll just have the uh, magnifying glass out. E. Tumble dryer motor, do you think? Reckon. Small 6 volt battery. Two inverters. This one, when I carried it in, let's be quiet. Did you hear that? Water cooled. I've got a water cooled inverter. Which means that when I open that, it's been left out in the rain and full of, uh, full of water. Right. I think I need to strip that sink. So there ain't no room in here for it. Oh, and of course there's uh, this little There we go, a, assembled in China, a little Chinese early Davison. All right, you know, it feels weighty. Two screws underneath, the batteries could go under there, probably. Is there a make on it? Royal Quartz, oh, we're actually ticking. Ticky, ticky, ticky. Nice little piece anyway. Right, as I said, back to the... Oh, look at state. Look at state. Ten to seven. Ten to seven in the evening. And uh, I haven't even got in the house yet from work. 
so and it's dirty to go dirt oh the joys of being a scrap man a hobbyist scrap man i'm not putting oh i'm going in having me tea dinner dinner and it'll be dinner now because it's gone after it's gone after half past six hasn't it gonna be fresh night tonight beautiful clear sky uh but i'll see him in his garden been in my shed and i'll see you folk off youtube soon i'm gonna to have to i'm going to choose a different saying i am i promise right see you in a bit well it didn't take long to sort out those bags to strip the frame off this uh, stainless steel sink. I'll tell you what, I ain't much of an electrician, but that hardly uh, qualifies as an earthing clamp, does it? You know, from the other end, the other end was just wrapped round a, round a screw like that. No, a bit shoddy, even by my uh, shoddiness bits. Tell you what, I think they've used a full tube of plastic. I think they must have had a leak. <laughs> oh, Bodge Central, eh? Can't be so bad. Right. Onwards. Onwards. What did we get out of those bags? Not a great deal. I've got to be honest. Uh, he's getting a bit canny now in keeping all the bigger stuff. However, we got, you know, a little bit of copper out of it, some ferrules, tin, tin copper. I got some wire to strip from aluminium. We found a, a Samsung phone, sadly in a state uh, not very usable. Probably take that outside. I, I, I've heard about Samsung phones bursting into flames but to be honest that's been in a skip for a, a few days so unlikely to do so but one never knows we'll be a bit careful and I'm, get, I'm now collecting hundreds of these i'll we'll have to do something about them what did i see on the floor yeah there's a knife that we missed yeah broken knife cheap Shoddy and and magnetic, so we'll cut that in half of your grinder and throw it in the skip. Throw it in the metal tub. Whoa, did I show you that? Did I show you that one? Uh, also magnetic. Oh well, that may, might, might change the handle on that and make a, what does that say? Taiwan, stainless Taiwan, that might make a nice stripping knife, might do. That's it, I'm going in. Well, it's about time I packed in, look at it, it's pitch black. Uh, all we're going to do, we're going to leave this thing outside. So, uh, I don't know. Take it apart, see if the battery's in it. Another day. It's... Ah, bloody hell. It's five to nine. Five to nine. Bloody hell. I, I better be getting in. Well, they do tell you there's no, you know, no peace for the wicked. Well, I'm telling you, there's no rest for the righteous either. So, uh, in in his shed. I'll see you lot in another one.